Tonight, there's word international con men are posing as representatives of Publishers Clearinghouse. Instead of knocking at your door, these guys are calling with a big prize offer for you. You just can't resist. Yeah, News 6 has learned the, the latest victim lives in Volusia County. That's where investigator Mike Holfield takes us for this week's schemes and ripoffs. Welcome to a schemes and ripoffs debrief. So I talked to the fraud department there and he said it happens every day. They take four or five phone calls a day. With Volusia County Sheriff Michael Chitwood. This is a, a scam that we see all too often. The scam is built around the Publishers Clearinghouse Prize Patrol. But you've seen this on television. I have, but it happens to other people. Were they convincing? Yeah, kind of. That's 74-year-old Peter Vaccaro. Peter says it started with an email, then a non-stop barrage of calls from someone claiming to be with that legendary prize patrol. And he says, uh, no, you won $5,000. He kept saying, trust me, trust me to Pete. Well, Pete's hard of hearing anyway. His neighbor, Paulette White, joined News 6 for this meeting. She says she knew it was a scam. Too late. And I was gullible and I thought, wow, I won. He wired $250 via MoneyGram to North Carolina, the so-called registration fee, gone. He lives on a fixed income, and that was every penny he had. Turns out Vaccaro plays those publisher clearinghouse token games online, so he thought the call was legitimate. They live in a 55 and older community. That's the neighborhood they're going to target, folks who are living on a fixed income, and they gain their confidence and trust, and then off you go to make this investment. Company spokesman Chris Irving telling News 6, we have been working closely with law enforcement both in and out of the U.S. to identify the scam artists. Many of these scams now come from Jamaica. Now pay attention. Publishers Clearinghouse will never, never call in advance, and they never ask for money. Never. I've put together several links you can review so you don't get fooled. Just go to clickorlando.com. Mike Holfeld, News 6.